So you've heard of McGriddles, you've heard of bacon pancake dippers, you've heard of pancake and sausage corn dogs, but have you ever heard of sausage waffles? That's what we're making this morning. I'm not quite sure how this is gonna turn out, but we're gonna see, because if it turns out good, it'll be a great addition to my breakfast freezer meals whenever we have a breakfast freezer cooking day. Y'all know we love those little pancake things where we cover bacon with the pancake batter and it's like a little thing the kids can dip. Did we do the breakfast corn dogs where we covered sausage with pancake batter? Can't remember if we did that or not, but we love those. So we're gonna give these sausage waffles a try. You can also do it with bacon, but we're gonna use sausage. First, we just cook the sausage. We're just gonna finish off this box of Cracker Barrel buttermilk pancake mix with these. You just add an egg, a little bit of oil or melted butter, and some milk to turn it into waffles, because this is just the complete kind that all you have to do is add water for pancakes. If these turn out right, I think they would be good to make breakfast sandwiches with too, because you would already have the waffle with the sausage in it, and then you could just add like egg or egg and cheese. Some people like cheese on that. I don't like cheese on it, like the McGriddles from McDonald's. We've done homemade McGriddles before. I don't know why I'm talking so fast this morning. I've already had some coffee, but I feel like I'm in fast forward right now. Okay, I'm gonna go grab the waffle maker real quick. This won't take too long. You smell that sausage in? Okay, we're this is almost done. I'm gonna grab a bowl real quick. That's a waffle maker plugged up over here. And we're not gonna have to drain this sausage because there's not much to drain at all anyway. We're gonna put just a little bit of maple syrup in here with it once it gets done. I'll go ahead and mix up the waffle mixture. Looks like we're gonna have another pretty day out there today, y'all. You smell the sausage? Can you hand me some maple syrup over there? Yeah, they're normal waffles. They're just gonna have little bits of sausage in them. I'm gonna get my little meat chopper thing to break that sausage up a little more. Huh? You don't want it anymore? Okay. The kids are informing me that they want some regular waffles with sausage on the side. I guess they're having their doubts about this. So I'll make a few normal waffles and then we'll add some sausage and people can have sausage on the side. Oh, I love the smell of sausage in the morning, sausage or bacon. Just get you happy. No, not that happy. It gets you happy. Okay, I'm gonna put just a little bit of maple syrup in here with the sausage just to give it a little bit of sweetness there. Probably about a tablespoon in there with that pound of sausage. We'll mix that around a little bit. And then we'll sift this off the heat while we finish mixing up the waffle mix. Okay, we'll make a normal one or two. With this waffle maker, y'all, a lot of y'all are asking where I got it from. It came from Aldi probably about a year ago. No, I'm sorry, this is not an Aldi one. This one came from Walmart, it's a Farberware. I had one from Aldi that got broken that was not exactly like this. I'm trying to remember. The one that I had from Aldi, you could put a waffle on this side and then when you flipped it, you could open it again and put another waffle. I love that one. It got broken. I think Jacob accidentally knocked it off of maybe their refrigerator in there. I don't know. That's where I normally keep with the waffle makers. Anyway, that one got broken. So then I just got this one from Walmart. It's a Farberware. It was probably $15 to $20, I guess. Not for sure on that, but it's not a fancy one. What was I going to tell y'all about it anyway? I was going to tell y'all something. Oh yeah, it makes a really big waffle. So most of the time, like Manly and Sissy will share one of these and he might not even eat a whole half of it because it makes, you know, a really big one. They have those little mini waffle makers. Uh, we have one that has a gingerbread man on it and those are the perfect size waffles for kids. It's cold here. cold? Yeah. I think they're called like My Mini or something like that. It was one of the Christmas giveaways that we did last year. We gave away a set of the little mini things. It had like a waffle maker, a donut maker. Seems like there was four different things, but I can't remember what the other ones were. You want that? I'll take mine with blueberries. I'll take mine with blueberries and sausage. Okay, see? Adventurous. I have someone adventurous. I'm gonna put some sausage in over here. Titus wants the peanut butter banana egg waffle, the lacy waffles. We call them the lacy waffles because she's the one who told him about the recipe. Yeah, that's kind of awful. I think that's gonna be great. 
we'll keep it over here because you can't tell much of the difference. See? Yeah, I bet that'll be good. Mm -hmm. If you um, didn't put the maple syrup in there, you know what would be good? What? Like, I mean, even with the maple syrup, it might still be good, but if you made gravy and then just put gravy over the sausage waffle. Yeah. Not, not sounding great? It would. <laughs> Is this enough for just one, or is this I enough? I think it's enough for one, baby. Okay. Maybe just a little more than one, but I just pour all of it in there. Oh, yeah, see, that was just one. Woo, I'm gonna overflow over here. Scooch it over. Okay. We got some bacon left over, y'all. Oh, yeah, I forgot from last night, yeah. From last night, so I'm gonna just put that on the plate. Well, this one you definitely wanna make absolutely sure you do not open that thing until it says ready. You'll think it's gonna burn it, but it's not. Yeah. I just tasted up the sausage with the maple syrup on it, y'all. That's great. It's a little different. You know, you can get maple flavored sausage, but this is a little different. It's wonderful. <laughs> Let's see what this blueberry sausage would taste like. Really good. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's good. So you can see the sausage in there. Good job. That's a good car wheel, Speedy. Now do a flip, buddy. Okay. He finds the right spot for his flip. He's doing it. Here he goes, and there it is. We are now at Wally World. Titus needs some razors and different things. We're just gonna see what's happening in the Christmas section. Because let me just Probably tell you Probably a lot of stuff at Walmart, they get in the spirit early. This is what you need to know. See, we waited until the end of October, well, it's not quite the end yet, but you know, to go to Big Lots and fall, it was like, that's done, that's over. It's and time it, It's for just Christmas. beginning. Jingle ball the way here. But if you wanna see what the Jingle news- Jingle bells. <laughs> I'll say it again. <laughs> Jingle bells. Somebody <laughs> thought that I had some burnt brain cells because I joke a lot. There's no burnt brain cells right here. There's a lot of good brain cells there that I just like to have a good time. I'm just joking. But I'm not Some people joking. don't joke. I've, I've met people that don't know how to take a joke, and uh, when you meet those people, you pray for them. I because not. <laughs> <laughs> I'm not joking. They're not happy. If you want to check out any new seasonal things, you better do it right when they put it on the shelf, because it's going to be gone. I'm just yeah. telling you, it will be G-O-N-E. That's how I've been talking to Manly lately, because he wants to know how to spell everything. And what about Thanksgiving? I like Thanksgiving. We need more Thanksgiving um, gobble, gobble stuff. Oh, they don't have Charlie Brown on there. Ingles has Charlie Brown on their pumpkin things. I'm just saying, that's better. That's a cute sweater. My favorite color is Christmas lights. I saw a fall shirt that was so cute, and I was like, oh, I might get it next time. Uh, there was no next time. It was gone. That's cute. Let's we'll see, what does that white uh, brown one right there say? This one? Yeah. Oh, you may like this in the bed. Oh, farm fresh, cut and carry, pine, spruce, fir, Christmas trees. That is also beautiful. Put that one in the front, Daddy. I like it better in the front. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Come and start rearranging all yeah. Walmart stuff. Oh, we, don't like <laughs> we don't like that one right there. Now we want these to be a little bit differently rearranged. This is an unusual dress, y'all. Yeah. I don't know if y'all noticed this. The pockets in this. <laughs> you put something in those pockets and they fall out. You're gonna lose it. What is that? It's to just people want to show their ribs. <laughs> they do. You mean to tell me that they want to show ribs? Yeah. Or is that supposed to be something that you actually put on your head for Halloween <laughs> so you can look out? Walmart's got some nicer clothes, you know, than uh -huh, what they used yeah. to carry. Oh, yeah, yeah, they do. True. I mean, they really do. They used to carry uh, cowboy uh, jeans, but they stopped. There's a, a sweater dress right there. There you go. Almost like a onesie. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They put some buttons on the bottom. There's you. Yeah, they're Christmassy. They got snowflakes on them. You're getting the Christmas spirit right there. I mean, why aren't there turkey pajamas, you know? People don't get in the turkey spirit. No, no. Now, here's some more, Mama. Uh-huh. Right here. Leggings. Oh, 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 who wouldn't go? Yep. That says my heart grew three sizes in Georgia. We got to have some instant coffee for our coffee ice cream that we make, the Java chip. 
Brazil. I guess we had espresso last time. Do you think it needs to be espresso to be strong enough? I don't think that was strong, actually. You don't think what we have was strong? I don't. Oh, okay. Well, I guess we'll try that then. <clears throat> and we got to get the chocolate chips for it. Let's see. There we go. Yep, that's them. Mm-hmm. They still have their fall stuff right here. See, they're doing good. Maple bacon oatmeal. Dolly's got some pumpkin spice cookies. Yeah. These are cute. Pink Christmas jammies with the truck with the Christmas tree. Give it all away. But they still have fall ones over there. And these, oh, those are, I like that color right there. Oh, look at these slippers. Official cookie tester. <laughs> those are cute. Mama Claus also cute and look the bottoms of them have candy canes that would go perfect with those pink jammies over there because that's pink where the candy canes are you left me at the slippers Whoa. <laughs> i was trying to see if they got a vest oh folks i wasn't looking at that i was looking for a vest but look at that that could be your robe what did they call that me? on the what did they call that on the andy griffith show <laughs> your um you talking about me and this <laughs> that looks like something elvis wore before he would come out for his concert uh, well, all I can tell you, let's go over and I'll get some black uh, hair dye <laughs> and I'll shave these into sideburns and I'll say, thank you, thank you very much. thing, I'll have a blue Christmas. Uh, uh, <laughs> you want me to put this on right now and sing it? We ain't going to do it today, y'all. Not today. That is adorable. It's little kid Grinch Jamie's eye. Mm -mm. It's the Grinch. That would match perfect with that Grinch thing we saw at Big Lots. Yeah. Oh, nope, they're still falling over here. That's good. And they got it on clearance though, y'all. It's 25% off. All the fall is 25% off, see? And we still have a whole month of fall decorating. Well, you know? for Walmart, it's over. You know what I'm yeah, saying? well, they're getting rid of it, but it's, it's still... Until the next. If y'all need fall stuff, you better go now, because they got it for 25% off. There's still four weeks of fall, like fall decorating. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, but for Walmart. There's more... For Walmart, you know. it's time to cook the turkey. <laughs> Gift sets hitting the shelf. They have peppermint scent, Mrs. Myers, gingerbread, plumberry... Fall leaves. They still have the fall ones over here. I'm seeing some new ornaments this year. Yeah. Nice Look at this right here. I like this right here on the bottom. Oh yeah, we like those bigger ones. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's kind of country looking. Yeah, right that there. is. That's nice. That's a nice one. Rusty Bell, you know. Rusty Bell. Mm-hmm. That's, that's a nice. One. Oh, and look at this one. A rusty Merry Christmas. See, it looks old. I like this that one. one right here. That is $5.94. You know, I think they may sell these out right here. I'm going to go ahead and get these. Yeah, get one uh, of these and, too. It's only $1.98. Yeah, and this too, baby. Look, we'll have a oh, lot rusty. of rust. Oh, yeah. <laughs> rust. Yeah. We'll have a lot of rust on our tree. We have to be careful with this Christmas spirit hit us. Right oh, now. yeah. We'll put our Christmas tree up. Yeah, we got to be careful. Only we don't have one. We have to go cut one down. But look at this snowman. That's cute. It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. $4.98. Oh, look at the little gingerbread people. They're $6.44. Those are new. A lot of this stuff on this section is new, I believe. That Noel with the... Oh, does this do something? What do you do? Oh, okay. I knew you did something. Sing it, birdies. You would think they would do Noel, since it says Noel. You can do a village here. They got all the village stuff. My most favorite time of the year. Look, Daddy, there's you a Santa suit. You know what? I may go shoot horses like that. Oh, wouldn't that cheer people up? It that really would, would scare the horses, but it would cheer the people up. Like, oh, yeah. <laughs> I want everybody to keep a good, joyful spirit out there. Because we believe there was a baby born in a manger. What movie is that from? Look at there. I think it's from... That's, that's uh, really nice right there. Yeah, that's pretty. That's really nice. You know, now I'm personally not into the different colored Christmas trees. Like, if I was going to pick one, mm -hmm. I'd pick this one right here. And that's yeah. probably because I'm country. Hey, is that, is that a pre-lit? That's cute. That, yeah, I think it is. Yeah, it is. It's a pre-lit. Yeah. It's a pre-lit right there, Mama. That's neat. How much are those? Eighteen ninety-six. Those would be cute to sit, you know, like right in on each side of the door or something, you know. Oh, look at these sheet sets. Those are pretty. Flannel, they are $30.97. It ain't gonna be long, everybody. Nope.